And just to remind you, even if they did get to quantum bits, that would still be a finite breakdown that you couldn't go any further. It would still be the binary 101 calculations. It would just be much more minute, much more compressed, and much faster. That being said, um, there is a couple of means of testing for this. Um, there, according to the article I read, uh, Atoms of Space and Time, a new telescope is supposed to be going up this year that will detect two different levels of energy in, on in oncoming light. Um, to see the original article, go look up Atoms of Space and Time in Scientific American. Um, if these two energy levels are found, this would prove loop quantum gravity's existence. Um, if it disproved it, however, um, ba uh, basically if no evidence were, if this energy levels were not found, um, this would disprove loop quantum gravity. There would be no finite level. Therefore, um, the computer simulation analogy would not work. No uh, viable mechanism within known science uh, for somebody to create our universe. Therefore, no god. Therefore, no programmer. Therefore, no creator. Um, our universe is entirely binatural. Um, the second way is if string theory was proven uh, and loop quantum gravity was still proven. Uh, but I'll get to that in the next video.